at the admin section and in the admin section um, there's a lot of things you can do immediately from the start uh, first of all you go to the plugins what i would do and in the plugins there's a lot of plugins that are there and i would like to uh, switch them on from the beginning the um, breezywig editor gives you more options to uh, uh, play with fonts you can leave that off for the time being flv embed is if you want to play videos uh, you want to activate that by click simply clicking on activate uh, the dt search all blogs to search all the blogs that's something quite handy so you might want to activate that as well something i really like is the latest from each category to display on my site so i'll switch that plugin on and you can go through all the plugins, read them through and see what you really like and what you want to switch on. Um, I would say the main things uh, are these two. If you don't want to get any spam on your website, you click on Spam Karma. And the Akismet, if you have registered for free by, with WordPress, you can get a, a WordPress API key. And that's really quite handy to prevent spam from happening on your site as well. Um, the rest we need for video, for proper videos. What I would like is the recent videos. And I like to display the, of the WordPress uh, video press active, the VPIP, PIP active. I would like to have the WordPress recent posts active. And I'll show you in a minute why you want to activate these. Uh, WordPress FLV again. The WordPress sticky is quite nice to put a posting on the top so that people know it's always on top. People always know what you uh, really want to say or what uh, announcement you have to make or something like that. And the rest is just optional. So these are now active, which means now that if I go to the presentation site, the presentation area, at the moment I have only this theme available for, for people to use. Uh, in, at, the, at one stage we want to do more, but at this stage I want people to get used to the layout that we have and play around with it and get familiar with it and afterwards we can open it up for more things. Now you go to the widgets in there and the widgets are little options that appear in the sidebars. So in my standard layout what I've used is you go and drag this calendar up there, you go and drag the um, let's see, we have the, the pages, drag them up there, the, the recent videos we put in this one, the recent, that's the, no, the recent videos go to this one, and then here we also going to put the links, and the links after that you can style in your, and enter your own links that you want to. Um, the active blogs